textures. In this video, I'm just going to show you how to create a quick flower pattern design using the Mirami plugin. Now, I've just got there's the Mirami tool. It's from Astute Graphics. I'm using 17.1 Illustrator. So I'm just going to go and select the ellipse tool. Now, I've set the color of pink. Of course, you could set the color to anything. Of course, you could actually have a flower with different uh, colored leaves. Whatever. Obviously, this is a just a not very realistic, obviously, flower design. So, right, okay, I'm just going to extend that out slightly. And now, now with this this tool, the Mirror Me tool, just it's a plugin that comes in the toolbox. So just select that. And it basically applies symmetrical designs to using one key area. And there's the actual area. There's little two markers that actually indicate. You can see the, the actual color there. That's the active area. And all the rest is just a duplication now of that design. So you can, of course, create the flower design any point. And I'm just going to, there's nice petal designs just there. Right, Apply to selection or I could apply to layer, keep it persistent. But I'm just going to go for apply to selection. And so there's you actually got the, the actual initial flower. Now I'm actually just going to go to window, pathfinder, just quickly join those all together. That doesn't really make much difference. And I'm just going to add center to the design. So just a quick center. Right. And quickly align. Now, once you've actually got this design, I'm just going to resize it a bit. You can actually now go to the object, pattern, and make. And there you have it. We've actually got a flower design. Of course, you can modify the, flat, the actual flower in numerous ways. So you can just drag that up there. Maybe hold Alt down and actually duplicate the flower. So you can actually have the flower like that. And at any point, of course, you can always save a copy. So save a copy, click OK. And, and of course, I could now modify this in numerous other ways, create multiple different flowers. So once I've actually done that, I'm actually not going to, just going to cancel at this point. So I'm just going to get rid of that flower. Just move it up there a bit. And I'm just going to apply it to a circle. So there's a circle. And just there. There you have it. You've got a quick flower design, flower pattern in Illustrator 17.1, latest version of Illustrator. Hope you found this of interest.